Give me some teams that are not hyper offense. Please and thank you. Please give me some teams that are not hyper offense. How's that like 200 again? It's... It's a fat core with King Gambit Tinglu. Once the fat, I lead my boys. Wochen Arcanine. I mean, Wochen Glamorna. because I'm afraid of that King Gambit. So I gotta bring Gastro and Flutter. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Okay. King Gambit and Flutter, man. This play is probably to Terra Blast Iron Head. Little synthesis activating special attacks. So that's terrifying. Um, we have to protect. Just protect with the war chat. There's double protect here. Just <laughs> See what he does. See if he's gonna tear out. See if he's, he's, if he's gonna target. He doesn't tear out. He doesn't tear out. Okay. Lamar protects. Can't protects. Can get it, you sucker punch. He doesn't say on who. Florida main shadow ball on the Gamora. Okay. Now he probably thinks that I'm going to... Okay, now he terrors. On to you, probably Terra Fairy, yep. Means that a moon blast is probably coming. Which means that this was a fantastic terror by me. Absolutely great terror by me, then. If he has the Ting Lu, that's a problem we worry about then. Moon blast. Beat that up. That is almost half. That was a crit. Okay. I was like, there's no way. He's probably very confused right now. My favorite thing in Showdown was clicking that button and just everyone being absolutely dumbfounded about what the hell just happened. So let's dance. It's fine. Because he's gonna start taking a lot of damage by the end. Sixth? A quarter? Quarter sixth? Somewhere like that. We drew the King Gambit. That's fine. Now comes an Amoongus. I just gotta poison the Amoongus too. Shadow Ball! Oh, that hurts. Really? That really sucks. 
spiky shield. Giga runs the move into the flutter. No, double protect, double protect. Oh wait, I can kind of see what he's doing. Double protect. Fluttermane used protect, good, that's why I did that. It was worst case scenario if he protected and then I attacked into him. I have one of my mods put to sleep. The Wochad most likely. Okay. Exactly what I thought he was gonna do. Okay. Now what does he do? He could go for the attack. Or he could switch back in the King Gambit. Assuming that I'm gonna go for an attack. I think that's what he thinks is gonna do. And I really don't want to lose my Wo Chen to score. But I might not have a choice. Fluttermane, you I don't really see you having a purpose for the rest of this fight. Flutter, get in. Oh, I am on a tear right now, I tell you. I'm on a tear. In comes the King Gambit. Out comes the Wo Chen. I get to keep him. Out comes my Fluttermane. And if I'm really, really lucky. If I'm really, really lucky, he'll have spored the Glamora. Spore. No. I am 100% fine with that. Okay. It's a little, little bit of a weird mechanic that if you sucker punch a Pokemon that's asleep, it still goes through. Which is why the move is to hit this and hit Parish Sun. Just spam Parish Sun. Because if you click Sucker Punch on the Flutter, it still is going to hit. Iron Spiky Shield. My guess is that he Iron Head that slot. Flutter Man's asleep. Pow Tower. Why would you do that? Why are you going after the currently asleep man? Pollen Puff. You know what? That's fine. No, honestly, that's not great, because now he can basically go for an Iron Head for free. Gastro's fine with an Iron Head. He'll take that all day. He'll take that on the chin. I just gotta click Dazzling Gleam. Or do I click Hex? Not very effective. Dazzling Gleam is effective. This would do more damage to the Amoongus, who is currently the bigger threat. He's, maybe he doesn't know that Sucker Punch mechanic. Maybe he's just gonna assume, or gonna click it into Gastro. Which would make sense too, but a hybrid would make sense. A sword stance would also make sense by him. And another pollen puff, maybe. Another turn of sleep. Oh my god! God, I forget how good King Gamut is. That was unnecessary. Is this just gonna be another game where because I can't kill the stupid ass mushroom quick enough, I lose? Because that's really annoying. damage built up right now on these toxics. He 
he's switching. Nope. No switch. Does he not have Iron Head on this thing? I don't think he does. Alright. Oh, that's... That might be the most annoying option. That's a lot of damage coming off that thing now. A lot of damage coming off you too. Earth power. Venom shot. Get that Amoongus off the field. We drew the Amoongus. Oh, is it the Flutter coming back in? Arcanine. That's not great. Question mark, uh, in all honesty. That's still a decent amount. Kowtow into the Gastro. Four on two. Kind of lucky for me, it's my Stolly two. takes off. I think he's in Giga Drain. But he could be Assault Fest. I think I just double into it. Get, make, like, make sure it's dead. He withdraws Arcanine. Back out comes the Amogus. It's goddamn regenerator, so it's basically like nothing happened. Alright, cool. So he doesn't even get the boost of that terrifying combo. That was scary. I'm no longer sitting in my chair. I'm basically on top of my chair at this point. Thank you for the follow, man. He goes for the protect on the flutter just so we can get off that. Lucas has got to go. There we go. He's gonna click either score. He's gonna click score. Meta shock. That's a dead Amoongus. That is a dead Amoongus. Comes Arcanine. I don't care about your intimidate. We got 
that onto you. There's something he's going to attack into. This. No, I think he does. Because the Arcanine's not going to be able to do any damage. Because he sees that his only way to win is to double in. Shadow Ball. Eat it. We eat those. Flare Blitz. He did double. Surprising. Well, that's fine. That's a dead flutter. The crit wasn't necessary. It was dead. Four two down to a two nothing win. A battle. What a fight.